What is this? What is up my crazy subscriber? This is Joking John City 4 and today I want to talk about Sam Pepper. If you guys have not noticed yet, in the past few weeks there's this YouTuber by the name of Sam Pepper. He's been getting the most hate out of the whole YouTube community. And one of the main reasons why is because he uploaded a video along with his Vine friend and some other friend. So you see what happened was they were going to kidnap uh, a person, right? They were going to kidnap his friend who was the blonde kid that I showed you guys in the beginning of the clip. So they kidnapped this guy. And the thing is, it looks super fake as fuck. Because I know a car cannot stall on engine oil. It can only stall on transmission. You know, if you fuck up the transmission, the car stalls. And that happened to me once, so I know what the hell's up. And another thing that, that makes it more fake is that how the hell did he end up on the roof? Like, is he cannot carry, like, both bodies? Or is the, the one that's supposed to be pranked, you know, not notice that he's being carried by two people? I don't know what's going on here, but it looks super fake as fuck. But a lot of people fell for it. And, um, you know, pranksters are usually fake nowadays. You really cannot trust anybody. And um, this looks fake as fuck. The thing is, that's not, that's not what got the people mad. What got the people mad is that, you know, pretending to kill your best friend. Like, what the fuck? And yes, I do agree with that. It was the most... You know, unusual, dishonest act of all time. I'm, I'm surprised that white little blonde kid is still their friend. What is that? Then towards the end of the video, you can see how the video turns from being ugly into this big ass mush of rainbows. Like, what's going on? Because at the end, they start playing this free royalty ukulele. Like, we're supposed to be feeling better about the joke. I'm like, boy, you just fucking traumatized your best friend. And you got kidnapped, and then you got shot, and then he was just confessing a lot of shit. I believe that's why they play the free royalty ukulele over what the hell he was screaming about. Because there was just one little part, like maybe like 10 seconds, that he was screaming a bunch of shit, and they blocked it off. Like, what the hell was he screaming? I'm pretty sure he confessed something that he did not want to be confessing. So, um, so yeah, that happened. And then towards the end of the video, like all the way towards the end... They show a clip how they're still friends together. I'm like, what the fuck just happened? Boy, he just kidnapped your ass, fake killed himself, you confessed a bunch of shit, and you're still friends? Did he bribe you with money or something, supposedly? Like, I don't know. I believe these guys are not really actual best friends, but just business partners just getting paid each other. Like, oh, I'll give you, like, I don't know, $10,000 in order for you to, like, fall into this joke or something. I don't know, but I'm pretty sure all three of them were into the joke, but... You know, supposedly in the beginning of the video, they said that only Sam Pepper and the Viner were in the joke while the blonde kid was not. So that happened. And then a week ago, and by the way, this video that happened about the kidnapping happened like two to three weeks ago. So that happened. And then a week ago, uh, Sam Pepper posted a video about himself getting humiliated by his friends who supposedly pranked him. And then uh, what happened in this video was that, uh, you know, he was asleep. Heavy asleep. I'm surprised they didn't fucking wake him up along the process. And then his friends bury Sam Pepper in the sand. Naked, supposedly. And, you know, are we supposed to feel like, oh, look, Sam Pepper humiliated himself. Ha ha ha. All right, let's go back into liking Sam Pepper because it's just a prank, bro, right? Boy, you just fucking traumatized your ex-friend or whatever the fuck he is. Because as far as I know, he looks like a fucking robot from this point. I'm like, how can you fucking support that guy after what he did to you? So it's just a very, very, like, what the fuck roller coaster with this kid, Sam Pepper. I remember like a year ago, people were claiming he was a, he was a, what's it called? He was a child molester. So what the hell's going on with this guy, man? This guy has the whole fucked up year. And also he has the most fucked up video of the whole year besides that lady, that little fucking, that, that woman talking about fat people. Like this, this obviously takes the cake as the worst video of 2015. So, um, so yeah, that happened. And then also after all that hate, after he getting a lot of dislikes, he started to disable the likes and the dislikes. And along the process, he raised the Kickstarter uh, where you had to donate eight million dollars in order for him to get off YouTube, or just to, to delete his channel. But the thing is, he can create another channel and still be on YouTube. 
So, um, yeah, he's going to trick your ass if you even donate $8 million. And he also has some, you know, ranks of, like, if you donate $25,000, you get to delete his channel and record it for YouTube. Some bullshit like that. So, Sam Pepper, come on, man. You are obviously the worst YouTuber of 2015. Congratulations, bud. You ain't getting out of this one. Hopefully, you keep losing subs after all that act, even though you all still friends. Like, that's just fucking bullshit. You don't just pull it off, especially with what's been happening the past few months with ISIS and, you know, France attacks or whatever. It's just not a cool idea, bro. So, that's it, guys. Subscribe for more. You guys want to see more content.